is blind You must have read my mind Cause you're the only one Who's ever seen the part of me I've only dreamed Together feel so right The two of us are so alive This must be Yo, Teresa, are you holding out on me, Whitney? You've got that same glazed look I get when I daydream about Ethan. Uh, well, for your information, Teresa, I was just thinking about this feature. <laughs> you know, I'm so glad we're not going on the bus with the other kids, you know? It'll give us a chance to get settled in our hotel room and everything, and we'll be the first one on the slopes, you know? Yeah. Hey, you guys, you ready for the ski trip? Yeah. Yeah, yeah we're all set. <laughs> hey, Pesa Miguel, you look like you lost your best friend. Charity's not coming on the ski trip. All of a sudden, she doesn't want to be anywhere near me. Oh my gosh. I forgot. I told someone I'd go pick her up at her place. I'll see you guys later. All right, Bye. see you later. Bye. Hey, guys. Hey. Yeah, I heard y'all going on some big ski trip. Yeah, we are. Hey, man, you should come with us. Oh, sorry, man, but uh, skiing ain't my bag. Thanks anyway, y'all. Yeah, no problem. All right. Later. All right, later. I guess I'll see you guys up there. Okay, hey, uh, I'll up. Teresa, dear, better go. Right. Um, I just wanted to talk to Ethan for another minute. Now, you know I don't want to miss our reservations, and you know how much this trip means to me. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> um, well, don't work too hard, Ethan. You deserve some R and R. Yeah, I've been telling my son the same thing, Teresa. He, he needs to loosen up, and enjoy life a bit more. Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm just fine, Father. Thank you. You girls have a good time. Okay. Bye. Bye. I cannot wait to hit the slopes, you know? Forget about everything and everyone in harmony for three long days. <laughs> Neither. Come on. Hello. Hello. We have a reservation under Teresa Lopez Fitzgerald. Okay, one moment, please. I'm so excited. <laughs> I have a Miguel Lopez Fitzgerald. No, Teresa, will you try again, please? There's no Teresa here. I'm afraid we don't have a room for you. No, 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 we signed up for this trip like weeks ago. You did remember to send in the reservation check, right? Well, of course I did, Winnie. I mean, what do you take me for? I, I wrote the check out, I stuck it in an envelope and put it right... Oh, my gosh. I never mailed it. Oh, man, where is your head, Teresa? Uh, you know what? Don't even answer that because I already know. Don't get upset, Winnie. Look, here's the check. Just give us another room and everything will be okay. Oh, no can do. We're completely booked. In fact, uh, there's not an available room in the entire area. Sorry, girls. Maybe next year. Well, I guess we better just leave. We can crash in my brother's room when he gets here. No thanks. I don't want to share a room with a bunch of people. Besides, it wouldn't be fair to Miguel. Face it, Teresa, you blew it. No, we haven't. I know where we can stay, and it's better than any ski lodge. What are you smoking? Nothing. I still have a key from the time I was stranded with Ethan. It's perfect. And the best part is, it's hardly ever used. We'll have the whole place to ourselves. Vamanos, amiga. You can thank me later. Adios mio.